I'm going to be doing a review for the original makeup eraser. Even though this was sent to me, I still want to do an honest review because I've seen so many mixed reviews about how it works for them or how it doesn't. So I'm kind of excited to try this because I just really want to see if it works. And if it doesn't, that's okay too. It's because I know there's some other products out there that works for me but will not work for you or vice versa. So I think it's just you know giving it a try and that's what I'm gonna do so without further ado let's try this baby all right so for packaging it's really cute it's pink and the box kind of reminds me of that pink eraser I don't know if you guys know what I'm talking about and then it says here it'll save you $1,000 with the reusable makeup eraser. On the side right here, it says, remove your makeup with just water, waterproof mascara, removed in seconds. All natural, no chemicals, machine washable, no stains remain. Soft and promotes healthy skin. So when you open it, it comes in this little bag. And then the towel and the tag says it's 100% polyester machine wash cool delicate no chlorine bleach tumble dry low and that's all it says and there's no directions on how to use it Okay, so usually products like this, it, I feel like it should come in like directions, like step by step, like take it out of the box or what kind of water do you use? Do you use cold? Do you use warm? So I think, I think it should be warm water when you do it because I feel like the warm water would be, um, will remove it. It's like washing dishes, you know, like if you want it to dry properly, then you use warm water. But anyway, the towel, it's, it's pretty big. It's a good size. And this reminds me of a baby burp cloth. And I mean, it's very soft. So, okay, we'll see. So now I'm just going to go wet this. And let's get started. All right, so I just wet it and it looks like this now. So I wet it with warm water. Let me take off my, ow, my lashes. I've seen someone say um, to use the side with the tag. So that's what I'm gonna do on one side. And then for the other side, I'll use the one um, behind it, or the back of it. Don't know if I should squeeze out the water, if it's... Maybe, let me do it again. The first time I did it, I really um, squeezed it out. So, this one, it's still a little... It still has water, a little bit. Okay. So, let me start with my eye. So like this. So I don't know if you're supposed to, um, if you're supposed to wash it with soap first. Okay, I'm just rubbing. Okay, I'm rubbing it very lightly. Okay, let's see if my eyeliner came off. Oh, holy sh shit. <gasps> wow. Okay, the mascara. <gasps> oh, it's pretty much off. Oh wow. 
That's crazy. Holy crap! <laughs> okay. Oh my god. I don't even know what to say right now. So I'm using the side for the tag on there. And I wet it with warm water. And I thought it would be um, really rough on my face because even cotton balls, cotton pads, like when I scrub it, it hurts. And this one, like, it feels really soft. Oh, wow. And I, I feel like I can just keep wiping my face and not get sensitive. Like it doesn't feel like it burns like when you use a um, makeup wipe. Oh, it feels so clean. What the heck? Okay, I'm going to try the lips now and see. And this should be hard to remove because it's a matte. And then my lip gloss has a lot of glitter. Oh, wow. And I don't even see any sign of lipstick on my, on my lips. Okay, that's crazy. And usually when I take my, um, what is that? <laughs> my makeup remover, like under here, especially if I did a smoky eye, I will get like this dark um, residue right here where I look like a panda. But with this, wow. Okay, so right now I've done one side of my face and that's what it looks like so pretty much all the mascara and it just came off right there and I did use the the side with the tag and right now since I've I think that took what like a minute that took like a minute a minute or two so now like I, I kind of start to feel um, the eraser to, um, it feels a little dry now. So I think you just have to keep wetting it if you have a whole bunch of different stuff like maybe for your body or, but this is pretty amazing. Okay, so now I'm going to do, I'm going to use the other side for this side of my face. <gasps> I decided to do the other side of this towel with cold water and see um, if it's going to make a difference. So now that I've done both sides, one with warm water and one with cold water, I'm kind of surprised by this right now. Like, I don't even know what to say, but <laughs> the makeup eraser works. So as you guys can see, it really works. And right now, I haven't washed my face with any um, facial wash. 
and my skin feels so clean that I don't know if I, if I want to wash it. No, I'm still going to wash it. Don't worry. But it's crazy how it works. So it pretty much did what it said on the box, which is a very big plus. My main concern would be um, this should have directions in the box because, I mean, even though this is pretty much self-explanatory, like some people won't get it. So directions that says, okay, do you wash it before you use it? So like for me, I'm not sure. So for me, I'm not sure about that. So I just went in and just rinsed it with warm water first. And I think it should say, do you use warm water or cold water or it doesn't matter. The only thing that I didn't like with this, it's because it didn't have any directions. Buy this in the future, even though this was given to me, I think in the future, once I'm done with this, um, I won't have a problem of purchasing this on my own because it works and I think I'm gonna save a lot of money with this and if you guys are interested in makeup eraser I'd be happy to put all the information down below where you can purchase it and yeah so this is definitely hello fritzy approved and if you guys want to see me do more reviews just please let me know um, the products that you want me to review and I'd be happy to try those out for you and yeah so thank you guys so much i hope this was helpful and have a good day bye guys Mwah.